because we're a worker-owned cooperative, uh, we people have a, their voice becomes the voice of the company, and co-ops themselves have been taking a lead in in the environmental efforts and trying to reduce uh, greenhouse gases and carbon footprints. So by developing who we are as a workplace democracy, we are essentially testing out and and and, and creating models. Um, by which we can, as, as a larger community, um, begin to operate in more egalitarian ways, ways that work for all of us, ways that don't lend themselves towards uh, hierarchical situations, which, um, which have been proven to be unsustainable. We're not just here to drive cabs and walk away. It's we want to be part of the Madison community. Union Cab is really going above and beyond in terms of you know sticking to our mission statement and in terms of not just providing you know, good reliable transportation to people but also in, in trying to be a positive impact on our community. We're an organization that we work together and we play together and we solve problems together and it is a unique group in that respect. We started looking at everything else. We started looking at light switches and solar panels and and really just uh, recycling and just everything else we could do. We have uh, rain gardens on our property. We do an herb garden in the summertime where it's it's not just any one thing. It's really a way of living now. You know, working in the shop on vehicles, on lots of petrochemicals, it's inherently um, dirty. So it's nice to work in a shop that is very conscious about not creating environmental hazards when we can help it. Right now we have some solar panels in about half of one of our buildings. We do have two buildings, so if we could double that or even go further, that would be a great thing to continue to explore improving. Ideally, we would like to strive towards energy independence, which is a pretty monstrous goal, but that's, that's what we're keeping out there as an ideal. And I'm really excited about our current possibilities towards expanding our solar array and, and exploring a new model of forming uh, partnerships with the community that would really empower local businesses to create their own energy future and, um, and not be beholden to these larger entities that uh, don't necessarily have our best interests at heart. Thank you.